we're gonna chop and slice and dice and grade and shred. If you are a fruit or vegetable that's in the building, I would be very worried because this hour is gonna be full of all kinds of fun things. My name is Sarah Anderson. Everything you need for the kitchen and some items you never even knew you needed. Not only am I gonna talk about Chopped, which is an exclusive brand here at HSN. We have some of your all-time favorites. And your all-time favorite guests like John Florell, who's here to talk about another great item from Chopped, which you will only find exclusively right. here at HSN. This is what we're calling the Chopped Speed Grater and Slicer. So if you thought every time you shred cheese, you were probably gonna shred your knuckles and your fingers at the same time. This keeps your hands away from the blade and gives the power to that easy crank. Right? How, about How simple that? is that? I mean, this everything so cool. goes right into the bowl. You pick whatever bowl you have at home. It could be a salad bowl, a fruit bowl, whatever it is, everything goes right into the bowl. I mean, look at how many slices we got in just a matter of seconds. And really, it doesn't matter what type of fruit or vegetable that you want sliced. All you do is put the vegetable inside, turn the handle, and it does the work for you. So with, whether for slicing, watch this. You, this is the coolest part about this. It's got this little plunger. That feeds it down to the end so you never waste anything. Hey, we've all had and tried these old four-sided tin can knuckle buster slicer grater things, right? When you get close yeah, to your fingers. Yeah, that looks very familiar. Yeah, you get a <laughs> manicure. Well, that's because they don't give you anything to protect your fingers. Well, with this machine, just the way this works, okay? It's got the chute on top. And let me just give you a quick run through here because it locks down to your countertop or tabletop. So simple. Right here on the side, there's a little knob. It says lock and unlock. So you place it down on your countertop, cutting board, table, twist that handle, and it's locked down on there solid. It's not gonna go anywhere. Okay, now the Fantastic. handle, yep, the handle comes off with this little, see this little uh, red tab right here? Okay, that comes off, the drums come out. It comes with three different drums. Now, I'm, I'm showing you the slicing drum first. This slices, it's, talk about speed. It gets through it quick, instead of using a knife. But you also get your coarse grater, and you get your fine grater. So to switch this out, if you didn't want to slice, let's say you wanted to grate something up, mm -hmm. all you do is slide this on, you, you, put, you push the handle until it clicks, okay? Once it clicks, all you do is turn. You're good to so, go. And <laughs> you can just leave this on your counter. Right. Uh, while you're prepping for dinner, so, while you're prepping for a party, have everything you need. By the way, the spring price is $20 off. So another big, fantastic way to save. We'll also take care of the shipping, so free shipping. We also do monthly <laughs> payment plans. Uh, you just... Look at this. Oh my I gosh, that was a zucchini? Zucchini for zucchini bread or zucchini muffins. Uh, how about this? How about carrots for carrot cake? Or for... You, you did that in uh, seconds. And all you do is push the vegetable through for salads, and then when you get close to your fingers, your fingers never get close to that blade, so you don't have to worry about cutting yourself. Everything goes into the drum, right into your bowl, and uh, I mean, you can do all kinds of fun things with this. I wow. mean, I showed you You're the carrots. Like any... How about this? How about potatoes for hash browns in the morning? I don't know anybody that doesn't like hash browns, but look at this. All you do is twist the handle, and it does <laughs> the work for you. There's an entire potato so turned into fast. perfect hash browns done in seconds. And it's all uniformly done. That's right. So you're not, you're not getting out any sharp knives. You're not trying to figure out how do I hold it, how do I shred it. Uh, you're not getting your fingers or your knuckles, That's right. God forbid, anywhere near those handheld shredders. This is great for cheese. This yep. is great for fruits. This yeah, is great this... for vegetables. You can do the potatoes. I'll show you again how simple this is, okay? Right here on the handle, I'm going to turn it around awesome. backwards here. You can see that little tab, okay? Now that little tab is what releases the handle. Here, let me you pull down on that tab, the handle comes off, and the drums come out. So if you don't want to slice, we'll, t we'll go to the fine grating blade this time, okay? I'm going to slide that in. This handle fits right over this, and all you do is push it on until you hear it click, then it's locked on there, lock it down to your countertop or tabletop, grab any bowl that you Look have at, at that. home. That is not going and, anywhere. <laughs> oh, that's solid. <laughs> <laughs> I could How move the this? table before I could move that. Next time you do some baking, you want to make some breadcrumbs, maybe for a chicken fish or a meatloaf, Take some saltines, put it inside, and all you do is turn the handle. Look wow. at that. I mean, you've got instant breadcrumbs. Or, if you, how about Look baking at how finely ground <laughs> for they cakes are too. and pies? Here, how about this? How about some uh, uh, some graham crackers for graham oh, cracker nothing crust? Nothing like a graham cracker right? crust. Oh, oh, I'll tell delicious. you what, it doesn't get much better than this. All you do is turn the handle, that super fine grating blade turns it into a, such a fine powder. That's going to give you the perfect, Isn't that great? the perfect. Look at that graham cracker crust. 
I mean, it doesn't get any finer than that. No lumps, humps, bumps, or chunks. Do you know my old technique <laughs> for that? making graham cracker crumbs? The old plastic bag and a oh, mallet. Yeah. <laughs> or the like rolling pin it flies all yeah, over yeah, the kitchen. Yeah, usually I make a big mess. <laughs> what I love about this tool is that there is no mess. That's right. You don't even have to get out a cutting board. You're not constantly scraping and Hard wiping Hard Parmesan out. cheese. I always say if this is the only thing that you were going to use this for, if this is it, just for your Parmesan, yeah. it's worth it for this alone. Look at this. <gasps> That's Look an entire that. block of Parmesan cheese. And I, I mean, you get, you want to talk about fine, super fine? Look at this. It's more like angel hair. It comes out of there perfect. Look at that. The texture is amazing. It's perfect for over the top of a lasagna or your pasta dishes and at home. And you didn't have to push hard. And you, you don't have, have to press to, like, down hard. Now, if you want a coarser grate, all you do is snap that t the handle, mm -hmm. put in the coarse drum, okay, the coarse grating drum, yeah. snap the handle back on, and you're ready to you're go. Ready so for your next ingredient. For softer cheese, How okay, about that? all you do is push and twist. And you, I mean, hey, if you're still using that old four-sided <laughs> knuckle buster, right? Where you, you know. Knuckle buster, <laughs> I like it. Band-aid not included. Knuckle buster, knuckle butcher, whatever you want to call it. But look at this. So true. Mounds and mounds and mounds of cheese. Look at that. And, and when you, you know, get close to your fingers with that knuckle so buster, you have to stop. With this, we have, with the speed grader, we have the plunger, so you never waste anything. It takes it right down to the very last little, look at that. And I you mean, it's never perfect. get your fingers anywhere near the blade. Do you know you always pay extra? To oh, buy I know. Shredded Why buy cheese? it? Shred it up like that. You don't even know. No, you can do it. It's the cheaper. The quality of the cheese. It's so much cheaper if you buy it by the block. That's right. And all you need is just a great tool. Today it's twenty dollars off. This? Today we have free shipping. Think about all the great things that you can make, or maybe the things that you're not making, simply because you didn't want to get out the old knuckle buster. Well, That's right. now there's a chance that you can do this yourself at home. You can do the cheese. You can do the fruits. You can do the vegetables. How about hard-boiled eggs Veggie for egg pasta? salad? For tuna fish or chicken salad? I mean. Oh. Instead oh, of mashing idea. your hard-boiled eggs with a knife or with a fork, now you can run them through the grater. You get perfectly grated hard-boiled eggs. I mean, and look at that. <laughs> In seconds. How wow. long would that take you to smush with a fork? Oh, and by the way, how about this? Here, I'm going to show you real quick how okay. to change this out. Uh, this by the way, there are parts. two colors. There's gray or red, just so you know, when you are let's, ordering. Let's face it. I mean, if, some, if a kitchen tool is hard to clean, you'll never use it, right? Mm -hmm. So this is so easy. It's all you do is right here on the side. See this little collar? You turn that collar, the entire top comes off. So now yeah. you can pop that apart. Everything goes right into the dishwasher. Everything is dishwasher safe, ready to go. Fantastic. You put it back together again, and you're ready to go. Here, I'm going to switch this out for a clean one because i got to okay. show you some desserts. <laughs> So. Watch this. Now, you, uh, to put it back on, you place it on top, twist the collar. It's locked in place. It's not going to go anywhere. You choose the drum that you want to use, okay, and I'm going to go way? to that coarse drum. <laughs> All right. The Snap word. the handle on. I know I get excited here. <laughs> but well, this here, makes your life so much this. easier. It, it really does. I mean, it makes sense, right? Why waste all that time? How about this? How about some M&M's? All right. Oh, oh, well, oh, oh, yeah. How about for some dessert toppings? Again, with that coarse grating blade, all you do is turn the handle. You get your grated <laughs> M&M's. You can do chocolate, oh, coconut. Uh, yeah, carrots, ice cream coconut. Yeah, ice cream toppings for cakes or pies. How about this? Grated walnuts, almonds, cashews, peanuts like this for an ice cream mm -hmm. topping. All you do is push and twist. And so, look at that, it comes out perfect. Yeah, so uniform. <laughs> and notice how the, the food doesn't get caught in the blade, That's which right. I think is really impressive. And look at this now. So here, oh, we've got some ice cream up here in the front. We'll oh. top that off. Look at that. I mean, in a matter of seconds, the kids can do this for themselves now because you don't have to worry about losing fingernails, losing knuckles, because all the cutting edges are covered up. Right, and, and you're not making a big mess. Even if you do get out your cutting board and your big knife and you're trying to do the, the rolly or the smashy right. or you're getting out the hammer or the mallet, uh, it's so much easier to just have one tool that does everything that you need. And to get it home for $20 off, it's a perfect time to try this. This is from Chopped, by the way, a yep. famous show on the Food Network. So if you've been following those chefs and following all their great recipes, well, this is a perfect way to implement that into your life. And, and think about that. What'd you just put in there? This box of chocolate. Oh. Okay. All you do is place it on yeah. top, turn the handle. Now you can do shaved chocolate too with the slicing blade. Remember, I'm showing you the coarse grating blade. We also have the fine blade if you like it more fine, or you can have it shredded, but look at that, grated chocolate for wow. the top of your ice cream sundaes. Is this real ice cream? That's real ice cream, yes. <laughs> <laughs> so I can really <laughs> Go for it, go for mm. it. 
So, so basically, all you do is figure out what it is. Like, let's say, for example, Perfect. you want to you want to do some hash or some uh, potato pancakes. Okay, you want to do potato pancakes. Mm -hmm. You don't want the coarse blade. You pop that out. We're gonna go to the fine mm. blade. You know, I showed you the hash browns. But look at this. You want it super fine, great on potatoes. All you do is push and twist. And look at this. Perfect consistency for your potato pancakes, for hash browns. You do this with carrots, coconut, chocolate, anything oh, like that a you would normally. Cake? Oh yeah, for carrot cake, yeah. zucchini bread for or for zucchini muffins, and then you can twist Look this. Look at that! All right, the top the top pops off. Everything goes into the bowl. Dishwasher safe. Right? You no clean mess. It. It's so simple to clean. Throw everything in the dishwasher. Uh, red will be the first to sell out, by the way. This, as an ice cream topping, is amazing. You know why? You don't have those <coughs> big chunks of nuts. You don't have those, you know, oversized right. giant chocolate pieces. You just get it just the way you want it. This so, would be great if you if you do a lot of baking and you want to add nuts to just about anything. Mm. I mean, even just for slicing carrots. And I want you to notice, every piece that I put in here is exactly the same as the last because of the design of this. It's not like a knife where you get a thick slice, then a thin slice, and then your finger slice. <laughs> because of that little uh, pusher on top. You know what? Look at this. this They're is, all this exactly the same. This is a great idea. All exactly the same. Yeah. Uniform size. If How you are this? making salads. Take a bunch of radishes. Place them in the, in the little hopper up here. Okay. All you do is turn the handle. You're doing four or five radishes at a time. And wow. they all come out the exact same. Did you know my biggest excuse for not eating more salads? It's kind of a it's pain to do all the, up the prep vegetables. work, right? <laughs> this is know. like having your own little sous chef named John do everything for you. Uh, but the, the cool the thing is... The speed slicer does the work. Anybody can crank a handle. That's it. You don't have to be good with knives. You don't have to go to culinary school. You don't have to be an expert chef. Here. Just about here. anything and everything you can feed in there, right? I'm going to chop these uh, leafy bits off here. Okay. And watch this, because for slicing celery, you know, in the kitchen, if your kitchen sounds like a, a war zone because of the knives hitting the countertops or cutting boards, yeah. look at this. Slice celery, right, it, right for a soup pot, or you can do this right into a salad bowl. Oh, and then when you get close to your fingers, you've got so that plunger on fast. top. Takes it right down to the end. And look at that, perfect so celery really slices. faster and safer. It is. It's, any that's other, why we call it the speed any grater. Any other, other style of chopping or slicing <laughs> or dicing that we've it done. It saves you time slicing and this. it saves you time cleaning. Yeah, if you have family around, if you've got the kids, you want to get the kids involved in cooking. I love to cook with my nieces and nephews. They love it too. But you're not going to give them a big, so one of those cuckoo knives, Sudoku knives. <laughs> Right? Yeah, one of those fancy. You're not going to give him one of those big fancy Japanese blades and a cutting board and say, "Tell me when the celery's ready." You Look know? at this homemade potato say, chips. Yeah, you could do this at home. Yeah, homemade potato chips done in seconds. And again, they're all the same thickness. Here, let me pop this potato. Kind of got sideways on me. Pull this potato out. Get it out of there. You can do it. Yeah, I got you this. You can do it. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> all you do is twist the that handle, potato. and it does the work for you. I want you to see this. Look at this. All these slices are the same. So for scalloped potatoes, homemade potato chips, Ooh. potatoes are gratin. They're all the same thickness, so mm -hmm. they'll all cook up at the same time. Yeah, thinking so, about doing, you know, some coleslaw. Would this be good for coleslaw? Oh, it's great for coleslaw. Yeah, yeah take potato a quarter head of cabbage, put it on top. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. And you can Your grate or salad. slice. So it's easy to clean. That's mm -hmm. the best part, okay? Let's the show The drums those three come out. They're all again. dishwasher safe, okay? And you're getting all three blades. Yep. You're getting one with the fine grade. Of course. One the with fine. the the coarse grade, and then one with the slicing. So you get all three. You don't have to buy those separately. They're very durable, solid stainless steel blades. So it's so easy. For once, you don't have to get your hands anywhere near uh, the blades. You just let the chopper do here, the work for you. do this real you. quick. I know we're kind of limited on time. We've only got about a minute left yes. here. This is the one we just grated that okay. chocolate with. I'm gonna time put the one fine one, ice cream. <laughs> the fine blade back <laughs> in here, snap the handle on, and here. Normally I'd clean my kitchen, but I know we're limited on time, so I'm just gonna do this real okay. quick. Again, if this is all you use it for, mm -hmm. just for making breadcrumbs, look at this. Chicken, fish, or meatloaf, you can bread them right, I'll tell you your what. Parmesan. Take, yeah, take your Parmesan your nuts, cheese. Anything your fine, chocolates. it comes out so fine. Look at this, and you can't cut yourself. I mean, instead of taking out the rolling pin and a plastic zip bag, you know, <laughs> now, it goes right into the bowl, add your seasonings, okay? Add your seasonings, 
Sprinkle that right over your chicken fish or meatloaf, right? You're going to go back to your favorite family recipes and you're going to be able to make it in like half the time. <laughs> you really right? will. I mean, it could be your grandmother's recipe. It could be your favorite soup recipe. It could be, it yep. could be, you're just trying to eat more salads, you know, trying to be a little bit healthier, trying to eat a little cleaner. You want to eat more fresh fruits and go. vegetables. This, this is the answer because it's so much I mean, faster and so much safer. just for those hard cheeses like Parmesan or Romano, I'm doing Parmesan cheese here. <laughs> Look at the mounds of cheese that come through that machine. You could open up an Italian. <laughs> Italian restaurant with this. <laughs> okay, and bread has sold twist. out. It's gray only. And again, I love how it suction cups right to the table so it's super safe. It never gets jostled around. Oh. All right, oh, these are cow. selling out. So we got to we gotta go. <laughs> oh, Speaking okay. of shopping, uh, John Florell, you stick around. We have some more slicing and dicing to do. <laughs> it is a, we have like two of the most amazing chef machines in our kitchen today. This is the Tower Slicer and Quick Chopper. It comes with five blades and it's also at a spring price today. $39.95, $20 off, free shipping, four flexible payments, and that's also from Chopped. If you love the show and you love those amazing food contests and they're really great recipes, you can find all of those exclusively here at HSN. Uh, by the way, if you see something that you already own, we'd love to hear from you. <laughs> I'll just talk in between your chops. There He's you actually hacking an animal carcass <laughs> as we speak. You are cutting through ribs, bone. Ribs, right through the bone you if you have to. You are cutting through because bone. Because of the weight and, the, and the, the, the surgical steel. I mean, this <laughs> blade is super, super sharp, but it's also, you can see, it's very durable. It's got a full tang handle. The blade goes all the way through the blade, uh, all the way through the handle, triple riveted. So this gives you the weight and the power to do those chops, to, to chop, Slice, dice, you can do it all wow. with this cleaver. If you don't have a cleaver in your arsenal of, of knives in your kitchen, mm -hmm. you really, really need one. And I was just looking at this price, holy cow. Yeah, I just, I uh, mean, uh, let me just really? mention this in case you missed it, it's $14.95 <laughs> <laughs> for the chopped stainless steel seven inches. This is a champion cleaver. This is already a customer picks. There's lots of rave reviews on our website at hsn.com. All around chef's tool, multi-purpose knife. That's right. It can cut through bone. It's it's yeah. so nice and wide. You can also use it to scape oh, yeah. or slice. I mean, disjoint chicken. Uh, I mean, whatever, it goes right through the bone. So you can cut, you know, take the leg bones off of the thighs. You can do the, the tips of the wings. All you do is move the knife and it mm -hmm. cuts, and it cuts right through the bone. Softer bones. I mean, if you're, you know, you don't, you're not going to do the leg bone of a beef or anything. Okay. <laughs> but for softer <laughs> bones, and not just for meat, okay? You're going to use this for veggies all the time. I like to show you with the different meats, though, because... Really, this knife is so sharp, and when you get Whoa. to a bone, because of that solid steel, you can use your hand to go all the way through there, cut perfect salmon steaks for the grill without, I mean, skin, bone, wow. and all. Look at, and again, when you get to the bone, you don't be Done. afraid to use that, the weight of that handle, or the weight of that blade, to do the work for you. How about, and it's less than $15. I thought, I mean, I've seen knives like this, and I thought they were a lot more expensive. Right. right? than $14.95, but this is from Chopped, and you know if they're gonna put their name on yeah. something, uh, the chefs at Chopped want you to have the very best. If it doesn't chop, it might as well not even have its That's name right. on. But you are like <laughs> I mean, slicing it literally, through a pineapple. It'll cut everything but bad habits and taxes. I mean, really, you will use this <laughs> knife every single day. And for those tougher jobs, I mean, stuff that you normally would have a hard time using a normal kitchen knife, mm -hmm. now you can use this cleaver to get the job done safe, fast, quick and easy, Easy, and everything comes out just like you like it because you have the weight of that blade. It does way more yeah. work. I mean, Talk here's about one thing. How important that is to have the right balance well, and and the full tang construction, which means the metal yes. from the blade goes, goes all the way all into the, way the handle. The blade is not separate, so you don't ever want the blade of a handle to go flying off. That's right. While you're chopping or cooking, very very dangerous. Plus, it has triple rivets, so it is going to be very secure. This is. A really impressive construction. Look at this. I mean, my mother, okay, I, can I can't tell you how many times my mother That's called me into the squash. kitchen to cut squash. And I love squash, <laughs> all right? But she always said, John, you've been doing this for how long now? Why not make something that will cut squash? Make a, a squash cutter. Well, this is what this does. I mean, that handle, the weight mm -hmm. of the knife, it allows you to cut through those really tough things that normal, you know, normally you would have a hard time doing with a normal kitchen knife. Now you can do it with that cleaver. That's why it's important to have a cleaver in every kitchen so drawer. So impressive. You know, I, I'll be honest, sometimes I just walk past the full 
whole squashes at the grocery store. <laughs> right. So I'm like, I don't know how to cut that. I'm afraid. I don't know if my knife's going to work. And then I end up buying the more expensive pre-cut squash where they probably charge me yep. two or three times the price, right? Uh, I could have cut my own squash at home and saved a bundle. <laughs> you can. I mean, look at this. This gives you the weight, the power. It gives you the control because of that extra thick, extra large, heavy blade. Now, I want wow. you to notice, for delicate work, too, here, let me scoop these up. We'll mm -hmm. put these down here. You kind tree. of also use it like a spatula. Absolutely. You can sort That's of, like, slide a bunch of food on it. one of the best parts about this. That's so if nice. you want to chop up, yeah, even something like a garlic. You want to peel garlic? You can do one or two cloves at a time. Place the blade right, right over the top. Smash. Look, there is your garlic. Smash. <laughs> and red, it's already peeled. Look at that. So you pull that out. Now, if you want to mince it, that's the best part about these. You see how that blade does not lay flat on the cutting board? It actually rocks back and forth a little bit. Okay. So for dicing, mincing, it's perfectly balanced for that. And you can do this literally in seconds. And then scoop and serve. Wow, so, you pop, pop it right in the soup pot. <laughs> yeah, right in the soup pot. And then, is it easy to clean? Dishwasher safe. Or I tell everybody, all you need is a kitchen towel. So clean them off. Okay. Let them air dry, or you can you can put them in the dishwasher. But I tell everybody with your good kitchen knives, <laughs> don't put them in the dishwasher because that blade is uh -huh. razor sharp, and you don't want that dinging into your no. uh, you know your butter knives and your uh, kitchen plates. But if you need a knife sharpener, we have one coming up next. Yep. So stick around. Um, this is something you probably don't have, you know, that you didn't even realize you needed because it's so expensive. So inexpensive today, $14.95. So if you want a few other ideas and inspirations for cooking, check out Mark Murphy. He is the professional chef and the judge on Chopped. Check out his cookbook, Seasoned with Authority. It's $19.95. We have free shipping on that as well. So, so far, you haven't paid any shipping and handling today. And you've seen every possible fruit and vegetable decimated in front of your very own eyes. John, yeah, stick, ar it. stick around, John. You, um, you're, we're not done with you yet. Okay. So if you want to get $10 off today, go to our HSN credit card. It's so easy to apply and buy today. In fact, if you apply and you're brand new to that HSN credit card, we'll give you $10 off your very first purchase. $10 off means you get that meat cleaver for $5. Right. You get the uh, the gorgeous champion cleaver. So another great way to tune is check out all the collections on hsn.com. But let's dive into our next item, which is the tower. This is a tower of power. <laughs> the Can tower I call it of that? power. Absolutely. Okay, we just made up a new name. If you only use this for dicing onions, it's worth every penny for this one single job. All you do is press. There's an entire bowl full of chopped onions, and it's done in seconds. I mean, if that's all you ever use it for, here, I'm going to put this out here on the plate. Watch right. this. You guys can see this at home. They come out perfectly diced, perfectly minced. For tuna fish, chicken salad, homemade meatloaf, for taco night, for chili, you're going to love it just for onions alone. But Isn't that fantastic? It and does again, so much more. <laughs> it does. It's the tower of power. That's it right. comes with five blades, and it works as your quick chopper. It's $39.95. <laughs> we have free shipping. We have four flexible payments. If you happen to already own it, gosh, I'd love to hear from you. Find out what recipes you're loving, how much it's making your life easier. Because I'm going to try and show this you this, about. okay? I haven't tried this yet, so okay. let me. I'm going to hold this up so the camera can see underneath, okay? When you push down on the top, now I've got a couple of hard-boiled eggs in there. Mm -hmm. You can see how those blades separate the food, okay, into a perfect ah. dice. So if you want to do hard-boiled eggs instead of mushing them with a, a knife or a fork, you can do three or four hard-boiled eggs at a time. All you do... And again, I'm, I haven't done this yet, so this, you guys are with so me. So far, so yeah. good, John. <laughs> Look at this. All you do is press <laughs> down the lid, and that's what separates the food. It's like having 12 little knives inside there, all doing the work for you. It goes into its own little bowl, okay? Okay. Or, you, if you don't want to do it into a bowl like this, you can do everything right on your countertop or tabletop. Or, it's into a salad bowl. So Fantastic. And yeah. the, again, you're not getting out a knife. You're not right. getting out a cutting board. This is doing all the work for you. We have, I think, three colors, or at least two. We have the gray and we have the red. So uh, last time, our red sold out very quickly. So uh, Here, gray or red, We're going to show you this over a salad bowl, too, because for dicing onions, like I said before, if this is all you use it for, just for dicing onions, it's worth it for this one job. It comes with the fine blade, which we have in here right now. Mm -hmm. If you want bigger pieces, you can use the larger blade. I'm going to do it. I'm going to 
do an onion and a half into the bowl like this. And then here's all you do to change the blade, okay? You just pop this out. We're gonna see if we can pop that out of there. And you go to the you large wanna... blade, which is right here. Sorry okay. to reach. No. Excuse you me. slide it over the top, and now you can see the difference in the size of those holes, okay? Now you're gonna get bigger pieces. Hey, on taco night, you're gonna love this. For dicing tomatoes for tacos, for salsa, for homemade spaghetti sauce, or for, to, for homemade, uh, well, my favorite, thick and chunky salsa. There you Here, go. Here's, we're gonna do two whole Ooh, tomatoes, okay? What you do that? is you slice them in half, place them on top mm -hmm. of that grate, and press, and look at this. We're halfway to a to a perfect Greek salad. Isn't that nice? Here, you want to? If you try to cut <laughs> knives with a, I mean, try to cut tomatoes with a dull knife, it just yep. ends up being a big. Add you know, a little like, feta, some, some black board. olives, and look at this. You've got a Greek salad all ready to go in literally seconds, and it's all done in the bowl. In okay. the bowl. In its own bowl. So you're not doing so, extra dishes. <laughs> right. You're not washing the cutting board in between items. That's right. And all the pieces can be exactly the same thickness because it's all done with that precision grate, or that precision uh, grate <laughs> on the machine. So think about so, it. If this is going to save you a lot of time and trouble, uh, it's the perfect time to place your order. It is $20 off today. Our regular price is $59. Today it's $20 off. So big spring savings for you. Also free shipping. There's never risk to buy anything here at HSN. We always give you 30 days to try it out risk-free. You know, get it home. Take it for a little test drive. Absolutely. Hey, your carrots, take a carrot. Place it on squash. top. Press. Look at this. Instant carrot sticks for a vegetable tray with a sour cream or an avocado dip. Now, these are gigantic, okay? Uh, these I call mm -hmm. these steak fries. Here, we'll put these over here on the tray. <laughs> <laughs> It's not my idea of a steak Look, fry. You can do that with potatoes too. Look, Maybe you want you French fries? Place a potato on top. Look, all you do is press. Instant French fries. Big steak fries like you get in the restaurants. Now, yeah. if you want the regular French fries, wow. here's how now easy it is to change out. All you do is pop the, the, uh, the one grade out. Okay. You put the smaller one in. And now, with the same potato, you place that on top, and look at this. You got shoestring style potatoes, wow. french fries. Done, I mean, literally, I mean, how easy is that? The results are just gonna look so professional. <laughs> and your fingers never get close to the blades. Now, I've shown you just two blades that come with this today. That's all right. right? It's, this machine literally you does everything with the clicking. total of five blades. Should we show them everything they sure, get over here? absolutely. Uh, and walk us through, because all you do is choose gray or red, and that's just basically the case for your housing. Everyone gets the, the bowl that contains everything that you just chopped. Here are your different blades. So this is your, what would we call yep, that that's one? That's your the, thick dicing blade dicing or your blade. big french fry blade. Okay. You get the small dice or the small mincing dicer. blade and that's more for a julienne fry okay. or for smaller carrot sticks, zucchini spears. Now this is a special bonus. This is a, a spiral a spiralizer, all right, for oh, carrots and zucchini. Fantastic. That fits over the top. You can either do a straight or it's got the julienne, so you can make your zucchini pastas and things like that. And you get the wedger, okay, okay. the pusher top for like an apple. So, yep. And, and then you get the uh, pushers if you're going to push the food yep. through. Or and you here's need a how easy help. this is Please. to change, okay? All you Love do it. is take the top off. What you'll do, watch what I'm going to do here on the top. This is just the top of the machine. You twist the top like this, that comes off, the pusher comes out. So now instead of going with the one that, here, the one that for your grate, watch mm -hmm. this. I'm going to put this one in for the wedge. So you put the top back on, twist and lock, and you're all ready to go. So now you can do this into a bowl, as, into, into its own bowl as well. Okay. Okay. And so let's say, for example, you want to wedge a lime. All you do is press. You get perfect wedges ah. every time. So you can do this with lemon, lime, orange. I see. All you do is press. And I want you to see what you get because they come out perfect. I can smell if them If you already. have a bartender in your life, I mean, it's not going <laughs> to... Listen, they will love you <laughs> if you gave one of these as a gift. If you've ever bartended, you know that's like the worst prep it, it job really ever is. is slicing all the lemons and limes yep. before you Apples, shift. zucchini, cucumbers, anything you want to wedge. How about this? How about... You, even like something like a aroma tomato for a salad. All you do is press and you get those perfect wedges, okay, for garnishing a salad. I mean, it does way more work than you could ever want to do with a knife by hand. Right. And all you do is press down on it. How about potato wedges? All you do is put a potato on top, okay. press down on the lid, and look, you get perfect potato wedges ready to go into the oven. I mean, it doesn't get much better than that. Isn't that nice? Because <laughs> the great thing is, if, if you're someone who just does not want to be around knives, right. I'm left-handed. Now, if you if you know left-handed people, you know that they are more prone to accidents. That's right. They, just, they didn't design a lot of things. That's because kitchen tools are not made <laughs> for left-handers. They're not designed for. <laughs> I've been in the emergency room several times for left-handed accidents. If if that's you or someone in your family, or maybe you don't have the dexterity, or maybe you're just not comfortable 
around knives and a cutting board, or you just kind of want to cut down on the mess, you kind of want to simplify everything right. that's in your kitchen, you don't need 12 different knives of different shapes and sizes. All you need is the chopped chopper. This is the tower of power. The, the tower the, of power. Is, I love the way you say that. This is the blades. Because <laughs> really, you don't have to, you know, figure out how to work the knife. You don't That's have right. to worry about what knife to use or if the blade is too sharp or if the blade is too dull. All you do is set the food inside and let the chopper do the work. All you do is press yep. down, right? All you do is press down the Could lid. Could it be easier? It does all the work for you. So if your fingers never get close to the blades, and everything goes right down on the countertop or tabletop, or mm -hmm. it goes into the bowl. Like I just did these kiwis, we quartered those down. That's perfect for a fruit salad. Yeah. If, how about for rimming drinks? I mean, the, or like I said, just for wedged potatoes. If this is all you use it for, if you do a lot of this, you're gonna love this just because of the time that it saves you. But every single piece is, look, exactly like the last. So you get perfect uniform slices or cuts. So everybody can do it without getting your fingers cut because yeah. your fingers are never close to those blades. Especially if you decide to cook just once or twice a week and make enough food. Right. Like maybe you're making big chilies or big stews or big potato salads to take to church on Sunday or to last the family throughout the entire week. If you're really cooking for, you know, an, an entire army, you want something like this that can make the job so much faster, so much easier. If you love making potato salad in the summer, you know, the warmer months are just around the corner, this would be great for like potato salads, yep. egg salads, uh, big big green salads right. that you can serve everybody when they come over on a Friday night. Great appetizers, great for guacamole, and great for salsas, great for taco nights. and. Even Amazing. if it's just for making carrot sticks. I mean, we show you a lot of things that you can use this for here. But like I said, you, you don't have to use it for everything. Mm -hmm. If you if you chop onions, or if you hate chopping onions because you cry, you know, you yeah. sit there with a knife playing tic-tac-toe and then tears start rolling down your cheeks. Look, all you do is place an onion on top, a half okay. an onion right on top of that half grate. An onion. Place the lid on. No more smell on your hands, no tears in your eyes. You get a perfectly minced onion done literally in seconds. Also, you're not wasting food. Because a lot of times when I try to cut an onion without something like this, right. I have all the pieces that I couldn't cut, yep. or I'm afraid to cut, or that were too big, or got left off to the side. So there's no waste. And if you are trying to feed little ones, yep. you know how picky they are about the size and the shape oh, of I their know. food? You know, <laughs> you've got a few yourself. Uh, they're all growing up now. Yep. Think about it. You know, my my eight-year-old nephew only eats carrots if they're sliced a certain way. Really? This is this is super easy. Make all the kids super happy. All right, we got a wrap and roll. However, you do have a choice of the red or the gray. You're getting five blades, uh, and it even includes the uh, what you call the spiralizer. The spiralizer, yep. Right. So for the first time ever, you're getting the spiralizer blades. If you're trying to make that zucchini pasta or that, you know, more healthy veggie pastas, it's everything that you need. And it's $20 off today. So, John, thank you so much. It's a pleasure. Are we thank done you. with you? I don't know. I think yeah, so. I think so. <laughs> thank you, John. I'm kind of tired. All right. Okay. I'm going to go to the oxygen tank. <laughs> <laughs> don't miss a thing with our HSN app, available on Apple and Android devices. Get $10 off your first in-app purchase with code WELCOME10. Opt in to push notifications for early access to exclusive app-only deals. Shop faster than ever with exclusive new product videos, only on the iPhone. Watch HSN Live anytime, any place. And the new shop and search features make finding your favorites easier than ever. Search app on hsn.com to download. There's nothing more exciting than hunting for treasure. That's why every year we come to the biggest gem event in the world, the Tucson Gem Show. It's where collectors and gem lovers gather to find the most exotic and rare stones on the planet. But don't worry, you don't need to book a trip to Tucson because we're bringing our best discoveries to you. Join your favorite gemstone brands for the Tucson Gem Event. Ends tonight, only on HSN. You might just find your next treasure. It's HSN's President's Day Sale, and you won't want to miss it. Get great deals all weekend long on your favorite brands, like Cuisinart, Joy Mangano, Coraz, and Origami. Plus, these exclusive offers. Four or more flex pay on everything. Special pricing, free shipping, and five flex pay on select Beautyrest and Simmons mattresses. HSN's President's Day Sale, tonight at midnight. I'm Joy. I'm a mother. That's first and foremost. I'm curious, always curious. I'm a bit of a perfectionist and I'm an inventor. So when I'm designing product, it's all about making everyday life simpler. 
I guess that's just how I look at things. I find a lot of inspiration from just living my everyday life. And I think, boy, every day's a gift. Make joyful discoveries every day. scenes. Mark Gill is here. <laughs> I lurk. He, he told me he's Canadian. He, I didn't know that. He, he tells these things. Yes. <laughs> uh, but what he also doesn't know, but I know, is that every time we have a knife sharpener, Mark Gill, it sells out. Telling you what. We cannot keep knife sharpeners in stock. And I think most of us didn't even realize there was an affordable and easy way to get the perfect stainless steel blade every single time. Well, now the answer is here. It's called Any Sharp. It suctions to your countertop exactly. and it does the perfect preset angle every single time. How awesome is that? Exactly. You're right. It attaches with a suction cup just like that. So you know what? Safety first because we want to be able to keep your hands away from that blade when you're using it. Now listen, here's what a lot of people don't realize. This is your typical, uh, typical like bubble pack $8.99 department store on the peg knife right there. This one is considerably more expensive. But what a lot of people don't know is that edge when it comes out of the box is exactly the same. And that is where the any sharp comes into play and I'll show you what I mean okay come on over here now you're gonna put this on any countertop in your house whether it's uh, uh, you know marble granite uh, really doesn't matter now you know what I was using the yellow one before so let's go ahead and use that one because we've already started working with it and I want you to see that because right here is what I want you to look at these are the tungsten carbide sharpening teeth that's what it's all about right there tungsten carbide is harder than stainless steel so keep a close eye guys watch this first of all it's suction cup so your hand is nowhere near a handle or near that blade you're is going to start at the tail and go to the tip. One, two, three, four, five. That's it. And you can see the shavings coming off there. You just take a dry cloth. Now listen, if it's not as sharp as you want it to be, just do it again. And have a look here with one swipe. We're going to go ahead and we're going to go take care of that butter, that uh, eggplant. Now here's the thing that I want you to see, okay? This knife, I've dulled. I can't even score this guy. This is the expensive yeah, knife. Right. So come on over to our Any Sharp and watch this again. Tip to tail. One, two, three, four, uh, let's go mm. five and six. And you can see the shavings coming off there. It's regenerating and renewing that edge. So whether your knife is 20 bucks or 200, the edge is the same every single time. And I'm gonna prove that point one more time on our sponge. And this is actually kind of cool, okay? Now this is a, you know, a nice full tang, triple riveted knife. We mm -hmm. found this in our kitchen here, professional kitchen. You can see this. Guys, I'm pushing down on that sponge. It's not going anywhere. Have a look at that. Now watch. <laughs> one, two, three, four, five. Take a dry cloth, give it a little wipe, and now watch this with one swipe. That's how sharp wow. it is, you guys. And that's the difference. It doesn't matter what knife you have, it doesn't matter how big it is, it doesn't matter how long it is, it doesn't matter anything. As long as it's stainless steel, the Any Sharp is gonna keep it razor sharp just like out of the package. Any single knife in your exactly. drawer right now, and it's only $18. Today we have free shipping, we also have uh, four flexible payments for you. You can even do a serrated knife. This was the big one for me, because listen, I've played, uh, played with and owned a lot of wow. knife sharpeners, I test them all the time. They're usually three or four steps, there's different things you have to do, they're all made of rocks, but almost all of them say you cannot do a serrated knife. Well, watch this, all right? Okay. Because of the way this is built, because it's a suction cup on the counter and there's no handle to have to hold on to and there's no three steps, the only thing you have to make sure you don't do is push down on it because it will lock up. Nice and light from the back to the front. One, two, three, four, five. Take a dry cloth. If it's not as sharp as you want it to be, just mm -hmm. do it again. But guys, watch this. Now, the best bread, uh, uh, bread knife you ever had is the best bread Ooh. knife you ever had again. Look at how thin and perfect those slices are. Great again, for crusty breads. The best knife baguettes. is a safe knife. The easiest knife is a mm -hmm. safe knife. And it has nothing to do with the edge out of the box. The quality of the steel is how long the edge lasts. If you want your knives, no matter how much you paid for them, to perform like that every time, run them through the end of sharp before you use your knife in the kitchen. You're going to love it every 
time. Wow, so actually the worst thing is to have a dull knife. That's the most exactly. dangerous thing to have in the kitchen, a dull knife. That's when it slips. That's when it goes the wrong direction, or that's when it doesn't poke through the food. You need to have an any sharp at home. Now they do come in some fun colors. Uh, let me just share the colors with you so you know exactly how to order. We have the red here. There's mm -hmm. that suction cup that sticks right to the countertop so it doesn't go anywhere. We have red, we have cream, we have black, we have teal, and I think we're calling this the ochre? I think so, that's mm -hmm. that sort of a fun yellow spice color. So pick your color, red, cream, black, teal, or ochre. Uh, such an affordable price. Absolutely. I've had to sharpen knives at like a farmer's market right. or you go into one of those kitchen stores right. on a Saturday and they have this big knife sharpening sale. You could spend more to sharpen just one knife. Exactly. Professional kitchens will have their knives sharpened all the time. You're supposed to have your knives sharpened quite <laughs> a bit of time because it makes it a safe knife. And what I love about this knife sharpener is there's no rules. We talked about a cleaver a little bit earlier right. on. Doesn't matter how big or small that knife is, it's going to fit and run through the any sharp. One, two, three, four, five. Now you've got a knife that's going to perform like it did the day it came out of the box. Listen, guys, you're not supposed to use a cleaver for doing thin slices of tomatoes, <laughs> but you can do that with the any sharp. Remember, once you run it through there, it brings that mm -hmm. edge right back to where it was when it came out of the store. Now, listen, you can take this in different parts of your home as well. Take it out to the garage. Take it to the tackle box. It's tiny and it's suction cup based. You can use it basically anywhere. Now, it's going to work on any type of stainless steel knife like you've seen here, but these are carbon steel knives. And so many times the knife sharpeners that we buy out in the retail because they work on stones cannot sharpen these Well watch this you guys. It's the same as all of other uh, all of our other knives as long as it's stainless steel Even if it's carbon steel and you can see the shavings coming off mm -hmm. of the carbon steel blade guys That's a big deal. That means that those tungsten carbide teeth are never gonna wear out They're never gonna dull. It's gonna work as long wow. as you need it to and it does the perfect angle every time because that's the secret to Exa a good blade, Exactly. Right? It's well, a let me show you that a 20% angle Which uh, if you are trying to sharpen knives at home, this might be the way that you thought Right. If you're knives. thinking to yourself, well, hold on, I have a sharpener. It came with my knife set. This is not a sharpener. This is meant to remove burrs, and it's meant to be uh, used at exactly 20 degrees. So whether you go slow and steady or you're confident enough to give it one of these, unless you're at exactly 20 degrees, you might as well do this because all you're doing <laughs> is dulling your knife, okay? We could but... <laughs> be making our knives worse. Exactly. Imagine that. So if you just let the any sharp do it, you know it's sharp every single time, works with all your different blades, even the serrated ones, from right. the cleavers to the kitchen knives, something that if you're a hunter, if you're a fisherman, if you have something in your toolbox, you wanna make sure it's super sharp. I mean, think about how many times you will use this and how instantly it will pay for itself. Use it like twice. Exactly. It's already paid for itself. And I don't know about you, but it, it's even, you know, it's kind of a huge hassle to even take your knives to be professionally sharp. Exactly, and, right? it's exactly right. It's a whole and you other, know, you know, errand you gotta run. And again, the whole point of this is, all knives out of the box are the same. Then we go ahead and do something silly like use them. Well guys, have this on your <laughs> countertop. Pop it down here and all you're gonna do is a suction cup base. You're just gonna pop it right on just like that. Now you could, I could move this table around the kitchen. It really wouldn't matter. And all you're gonna do is you're gonna take any knife at all, serrated, carbon steel, stainless steel. One, two, three, four, and five. That's it, take a dry cloth. Wipe it off. If it's not got the edge you want, simply mm -hmm. go ahead and run it through it again. The bottom line is you don't need three steps. You don't need complicated equipment. You don't need electricity. All you need is the best knife sharpener you've ever put your hands on. And it's there to work for you every single time with those tungsten carbide blades. If you've got anything coming up, gifts, Father's Day, Mother's Day, weddings. Yeah. If you know somebody with a knife, that's a good gift. I was going to say, this is basically <laughs> for anybody, if you have a knife, you need a knife sharpener. How many of you don't even know the last time you sharpened your knife. When was the last time you sharpened your knife? Do you, do you remember? I mean, was it months ago? Was it years ago? Uh, there might be a reason you're thinking, oh, I need new knives. You might not need new knives. You might just need to sharpen the ones you already exactly. own. Exactly. Listen, the two most important tools in any kitchen are clean hands and a good knife. The second you start knocking that knife against the board, a cutting board, you start chopping it down, you're dulling it every single time. Every time you do that, you start to need to sharpen it. So whether you've paid three bucks for your knife or 300, it makes no <laughs> difference at all. One, two, three, 
four, once you get in there, <laughs> and five. <laughs> and that is as sharp as any $500 knife you'll buy at the store. All it means is, when you go to use it, run it through a couple of times, it's good as gold. Uh, these are very, very popular. Already more than 2,400 of you have said yes, and uh, we have about that amount to go around. So uh, again, red, cream, black, teal, or ochre. If you have used this once or twice, it's, it's paid for itself. If you've ever taken your knives to get professionally sharpened, uh, you easily spent $20 on one or two knives, plus the hassle of taking the trip. So this right. is everything you need for a fraction of the price of what you would spend anywhere else. Plus we have the free shipping, we even have the four flexible payments to make it that much easier. Now that you have all these really sharp knives, <laughs> let's clean them without cutting our fingers. We've got a solution for you. It's the Scrub Knife Cleaner Set by Kitchen Wise. It's $19.95, so $5 off today. Tell us about this one. You know what, this is actually very cool. You've gotta keep the knives clean to keep them, uh, you know, the, the rust off them and keep them uh, for a long time. So this has a suction cup as well. Goes right on the side of your sink. That's the basket holder. There's a finger guard in the back. Everything is silicone that the knife can't penetrate. So guys, now when it comes time to clean the knives in the sink the knife cleaner is right there the holder is right there and you never ever ever have to worry about oh, that I blade know. hitting your hand so you know if you've got kids in the house you love to get them to help with the uh with the dishes do the cleanup and all that kind of stuff there's finally a safe way to clean knives it's one of the coolest things that i've ever added to my kitchen because i'll tell you we all have rules don't put this in the bottom of this make sure you let us know make sure this make sure that how safe and easy is that? I love that it protects your fingers and the palm of your hand. You never want to wonder, was that the sharp side of the knife? Uh, <laughs> not, not a good thought to cross your mind. Thank you so much, Mark Gill. Thank Great you. to see you. And check out what's happening on our website at hsn.com. It's the iRoomba. Yeah, you're going to feel like doing the rumba with the Roomba because it's a robotic vacuum. It vacuums for you while you sit and watch. We have a spring price. That's $50 off today. Free shipping and five flexible payments for you. Uh, the iRoomba is one of our most popular items here at HSN. It gets rave reviews. So if you've always wanted to try it, well, now's the best time. You can check out that great spring price. If you're just tuning in, welcome into our hour of chopping and slicing and dicing and grating and shredding. I think, I think we destroyed every fruit and vegetable in the studio today. There's nothing that's safe from our kitchen experts here at HSN. Now, where are you gonna put all those great items that you might have purchased for your kitchen? Hopefully, you're gonna put it in the origami four drawer kitchen cart. Comes with that beautiful wood shelf, four giant storage drawers, and it's all completely assembled. You don't have to do a thing, you just take it out and it's instantly assembled for you. You get extra storage, you get four drawers, you get a ton of storage space. And today, we have a price break that's $20 off. Not only are you saving $20 off the price, you're saving with shipping and handling. That's another, oh, $19. So right now, you're saving $39 by placing your order with us today. It's on five flexible payments for you. If you want to be a part of the show, we'd love to hear from you. In fact, I know thousands and thousands and thousands of you already own our origami kitchen cart, origami exclusive to us here at HSN. It is simply the Japanese art of folding. And origami just makes your life easier. You're gonna see how great this is to use, and it comes on four wheels, so you can literally take it with you. Tracy Rose is here. Tracy Rosa, come on out, Hi, and friends. let's talk about our kitchen cart. Good to see you. Good to see you, too. How are you? I'm fantastic. I'm so glad this is back, and I'm glad that we have the great yeah. colors because this literally listen we call it the kitchen cart but you can literally use this in any single room in the house because this is our biggest and our best drawer storage system that we offer look at these I mean, this is what we're talking about. This is about capacity. Each one of these drawers is six inches deep, almost uh, about a foot half wide. And look at, you can store up to 15 pounds worth of weight in each one of them. But here, it's origami. So what does that mean? That means no work for you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it means no assembly, no tools, Imagine. no instructions, nothing crazy. It comes flat packed just like this, okay? The wheels aren't on. We give those to you separately because you decide whether or not you want the wheels on. But here you go, you open it up. Okay, mm -hmm. you put the top on, which is already screwed into, but you just fold it over, and you see that little peg right here? All you have to do is line that up with the two little holes here, and now this entire base is completely secure and ready to go. You don't need to get out a screwdriver, Nothing. a hammer, you don't need mm -hmm. to read instructions, you don't have to call customer service. Right. No fighting, <laughs> what, no hiding You don't have to list, call a friend you know? or argue with your husband. <laughs> right. 
right. And the great thing about these drawers is that they're all the same size. So we've taken the guesswork out of it. You don't have to kind of eyeball and say, oh, does the smaller drawer go here? Does it go there? It all fits perfectly. Mm -hmm. Another great feature about this, and I think, you know, it's in the details. There are no wheels here on these tracks. There's nothing you have to line up, which means there's nothing that can get off track as well. So you know what I'm talking about, those drawers that maybe get a little lopsided, you can't <clears throat> open, you can't close. Because of our tracks, it's still easy to glide. You've got that wonderful handle right here that's easy to grip and good to go. Another great feature, how the mesh metal is on this. There's never a question of what's in the drawer. You can see exactly, it's nice and thin. Again, you can see exactly what's in there and then nothing's gonna fall underneath that. That's huge for mm -hmm. me. So if you're a crafter and you're using this for crafting, you know, those sequins aren't gonna fall through, the really small particles aren't gonna fall through, beads won't fall through. If you're using it in a toy room, like Lego, stuff like that, right. this is gonna give everything that perfect The home. skin of the onions, yes. if you're using this for produce, that's not gonna fall through and create a big mess. Also, it just gives you extra countertop yes. space because on top, uh, let's give the overall dimensions here. It's going to be about 20 inches by about 18 inches mm -hmm. across the top. So 20 inches by 18 inches. It is 34 and three fourths of an inch in height. And that's when it's uh, open and ready to go. So it's about countertop. Perfect. Hi. Yep, exactly. So you can uh, create an additional countertop wherever you need. Now let's quickly talk about colors because okay. I know we are getting very limited. And this has been really popular, especially with the price bank mm -hmm. and with the free shipping that is available for yeah. you today. So you're you're saving thirty nine dollars uh, just by placing your order. Let's go over what we have. We have the red, uh -huh. which you see there. Yes. And the wood grain finish on top is so pretty. The red will be the most limited. That will be the first to sell out. This is going to be our silver. Yes which has that nice sort of a uh, pewter, sort of modern, mm -hmm. clean, industrial look. And look at that light oak on top here. So I want you to pay attention to the different colors of the wood with each one of those. So that light oak on the silver. And here's our turquoise, mm -hmm. one of our newer colors to the origami family. It's bright, it's fun, it's colorful, great for a bath, great for a walk-in closet or an organizer room. Right. And we also have it for you in the dark bronze. So mm -hmm. just so you know what colors we have, and again, if you own this, if you're one of the 632 people that gave us rave reviews on our website at HSN, uh, I'd love to hear from you because most of you said you were just blown away yeah. by the amount of space. Yeah. It gives you four giant drawers. I mean, the last time I checked, Nobody ever said they have too many drawers and too many closets in their house. I agree, and I don't have that problem. <laughs> if you do have too many drawers and closets, we haven't met yet. You're right, exactly. But for most of us. You know what that means? That means there's more room for shopping. There you go. <laughs> so for here, most of us, yeah. though, we're, we're craving more drawer space. Absolutely, and in all honesty, that is how it's used in our house. My daughter, my 13-year-old, she wanted to get rid of her dresser, and you gotta have a dresser. You know, where do you put everything? This was a perfect solution because it's that great height it's able to hang or you know roll up right underneath her hanging shirts so I got big, rid of the big dresser and now I've got two of these in her closet Perfect. underneath her shirts her hanging stuff and it serves every need but think of this in um, the bathroom because I want to talk about that for a second because I find that's one of the hardest rooms to find storage solutions for because your alternatives are particle board which is going to break mm -hmm. down with the heat and the humidity and all the moisture or that um, murky plastic yeah, you know, and it if gets moldy. Yes, and if you've ever put a, like a not all the way cooled down curling iron in there, you're gonna learn that that's not mm -hmm. a good combination. No. <laughs> no, or the ones that you have to build over your toilet. Oh yeah, no. yeah, forget about it. Yeah, how I, do you get to the top shelf? <laughs> I spent more time on my hands and knees behind the toilet trying to figure out how to put right. that thing in. I never want to go there again. Uh, so think about it, and the fact that it has wheels means it dub doubles as an extra countertop. It's almost like you know a kitchen island on wheels. It's like having this portable cabinet so wherever you go you can take everything with you yeah and let's let's think of the kitchen for just a second because we're calling it the kitchen cart but think of like your big appliances think of your coffee maker imagine having a coffee station you know either, whether it's in your house or mm -hmm. whether it's at an office this can be a bar this can be an appetizer station mm -hmm. this can be whatever you want it to be but all of the stuff that you need is right here at your fingertips we've got our coffee makers we've got the pods or the filters or whatever we need all of the coffee mugs not a question of what's in here because I see exactly what it is underneath there are teas 
and then more uh, more mugs. But now you have a system that's on wheels. So say it's a gorgeous day and your yeah. husband are out on the lanai and you want to have coffee there or you want to have cocktails out there. This is a great way Ooh, to I be like able to idea. move this around about mm -hmm. wherever you want. But it's about clearing up that real estate that we value so much and we spend so much money for in the kitchen, the countertops. You know, I mean, you we never we, have you enough never countertop have enough, space. You know, and these big <laughs> appliances take up so much room, whether it's the microwaves, the blenders, the pressure cooker, the mixers. Right. You know, where do you the store toaster that? Oven. The Yes. The coffee a lot pot. of times it either takes up the real estate of the um, countertops or they're mm. hidden, like out of sight, out of mind, like in cabinets, and then you never use them because you forget about them. Now you can have everything that you need. This can be the pantry if you need it to be. You can put all your spices strong enough for those big, heavy pots and pans. Um, again, storage, storage, storage. Look at, I can fit a whole set of pots and pans down here. And there's still enough room for whatever right. else I need. So remember that no matter, matter what color you pick, it's powder coated steel too. So that means that this is gonna stay pristine. It's not gonna rust, it's not gonna chip, it's not gonna corrode. You've got that steel and again, that beautiful mesh that allows you to see exactly what is in there. So there's never a question. <laughs> it's already one of our most popular origami items in the history of HSN and today it's $20 off and we're doing free shipping. So with the free shipping, you're saving $19. I mean, this is not small. I think it weighs, it weighs nearly 30 pounds. But we're going to take care of the shipping. We're going to take $20 off, so a total of $39 that you might spend another day uh, versus today. So it's a great time to think about every room in your home and think, gosh, where do I run out of drawer space? Is it a master bath? Well, maybe you have room for one of the carts. Maybe it's your walk-in closet. Maybe you wish that you could afford one of those custom closets. Well, guess what? Even if you had all the money in the world and installed a custom closet, when you move or the lease is up, you don't get to take it with you. <laughs> but you could add drawers inside a walk-in closet. Your laundry room. Maybe you want space for all the different, you know, laundry supplies or your ironing supplies. Or maybe it's just the washcloths, the towels. Maybe it's the garage. You know, maybe it's for tools. Mm -hmm. Maybe it's for the kids' outdoor toys. Maybe it's for all the, you know, poolside accessories. Maybe it's for beach towels. Wherever you are, you can probably use more drawers and you could probably use more countertop space. And so that's what I love about the kitchen cart because it really is the best of both worlds. And the fact that you can take it with you, you can move it around. I know we hear from so many of you and the only thing you regret is not buying more than one. Right. As soon as you get one home, you're like, why didn't I get one? <laughs> and then that color may not be garage. available, you know? And I, you know, this is what we're talking about. Look at the amount of stuff that we can put in here. I mean, obviously, it's a lot of fruits and vegetables. You know, if you're somebody <laughs> who goes to the farmer's market, you can appreciate how we have it propped up here. But then again, it's aerating. So things are staying fresher longer. They're not rotting from the bottom up on a big fruit tray or a big fruit bowl on your countertop. But again, you can put so much stuff in here, 15 pounds worth of weight, a ton of oranges, mm -hmm. and there's still a lot of room for that. Mm -hmm. The other thing, too. Is there a weight limit per drawer? 15 pounds. 15 pounds. Okay, and that's, good to know. that's a lot. I mean, that's a lot. And, and it's still going to slide. In Pan and out. foods, dog food, you know. Yeah. The wheels lock too. So again, there's <coughs> there's my friend Linda, and we've never met in person, but you kind of are my organization um, role model. She has three of these lined up in her garage. And the oh. wheels lock, so now she has a workspace here you know, that she can get all of her stuff done, but then she's got the four drawer system since she's got, you know, three of them, there are 12. But can you imagine how great that would be? Mm -hmm. I think of that and I'm thinking, I don't have a fancy closet. This could be a walk-in solution for me. I could have my jewelry, this could be a dressing station, and then my clutches, everything else could be right here in the drawers. It's that perfect footprint, you nailed mm -hmm. it. It's 20 inches by 18 inches, so it's not gonna take up a ton of space, and it's made of the best quality that you can get, wood and steel. And you know, if, if you've ever tried to build something that would be similar, that gave you extra countertop space or extra storage space or extra drawers, you know what a hassle those are to build. You know what a pain it is mm -hmm. to bring it home in this large flat package you can barely fit in the back of your car. And you know that sometimes there are pieces missing. I, I don't know if I told you the story, but since I moved to Florida, I bought something that I had to assemble <laughs> and I put it all together and the drawers wouldn't go in. Mm. So it was like, I can't believe I just spent two hours. Right. And now for some reason the drawers don't fit and I've got to start all over and I have to unpack it. 
take it apart and take it all back to the store. That's no fun. We're gonna take care of everything because it's so easy to assemble. I love this video because they show it actually outside. So if you're thinking, hey, it's almost outdoor season, maybe it's on the patio, maybe it's by the grill, maybe you have a backyard deck or a patio or a lanai where you're hanging out with friends and family. Maybe you just want more storage for anything that you want next to you in the living room. Maybe it's for magazines. Maybe it's for newspapers. Maybe it's for, you know, extra bathroom towels and linens and toilet paper and paper towels and I mean there's never enough space for all that stuff Tracy yeah and I'll tell you another thing it's good for like when we have guests come you know how many times do you find yourself like emptying out closets so that they have a place that they can unpack or feel comfortable this can now be their dresser this can be their unpack station all of their fresh linens could be here um, so think of just th really think outside the box and just think of where you could use all this extra storage Fun thing note, fun note, um, all of these will nest in like this. So if you ever decide to, that you need to store it, it's mm -hmm. literally gonna be like storing one drawer and then just a couple inches mm -hmm. of the base. But I have it stacked like this because again, this one is about capacity and the amount of stuff that you can really Giant store. Giant drawers. Huge. Giant drawers. Can you take it apart yeah. and put it together one more so time? Why you, We've only why got about a minute trying left. Trying to make me work so hard. Yeah. <laughs> You gotta, you gotta earn your keep today, Tracy. That's right, look at <laughs> Literally, you take it out of the box, you open it up. This top shelf is already attached, so okay. you fold it over, and really it's about lining up those pegs in the holes, right? See that little peg? You line it up with the hole, and now everything is secure. And, and then, it's done. And then it's, it's done. It's assembled. Yeah. It assembles in seconds, and the best part is if you need to move or put it in the closet, Take it to the next room, no problem. You are getting four drawers. Love the mesh design because you can always see through. This is also a huge favorite from our crafters. Yes. Who keep all their crafting supplies, who keep all their stationery or their art supplies. You could even see if your, you know, cutters and your machines and your stamp kits are inside. If you have kids that are working on school projects, this would be great to maybe their little after school station. You know, they could put their home.